Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to uh, Brigador and the Freelance Missions. Right, so hang on, what are we doing this time? What are we doing this week? Week? What are we doing today? Uh, let's find out. Today we're going to do a... Oxybellis with a Preacher and Banshee and an AKP. Okay, let's try that. Freelance, we're going to go for Doc Volhard. We're going to try Doc Volhard this time. Harder, with a higher multiplier though. Um... Oh god, no, back, 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 my mistake, that was the same weapon as last time. Resign. Uh, Vok Volhard in a... What was it? Oxybellis. Spacer. Mech with a... Banshee. And a Preacher. Right, is that the one? Oxybellis with Banshee and Preacher with an AKP. Okay. Um... Hmm. Okay, right. So, Oxybellis. What's the other multiplier in Oxybellis? 1.5 multiplier. Okay. So, 2.7, 1.5. We got a Preacher Cannon on the secondary, and the Banshee in primary. They should be crazy powerful, right? So far, so good. So far, so good. Eight of the garrison down. I haven't even really tried yet. Banshee machine gun is glorious, though. We, we learned this a while back, actually. The Banshee machine gun is absolutely glorious. Stomp. Go for the cannon. Go for the cannon. If you, don't need to use a, if you don't need to use a preacher, we won't use a preacher. Keep going with the cannon only. The, ca the cannon is a good like, like one shot shot, one shot weapon. Oh, need ammo and ammo and shielding. Nice. Right. This just looks like a big gun, though. The oxybell is the head of the oxybell. It just looks like a massive gun. Okay, so we gotta keep eye out for range stuff. They both have really good range. Let's step over into this area here. We're gonna go wham, wham, crush, wham. 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 Oh dear, hello. Turn around. Wham. Dead. Okay, good. So far, so good. All the substations are here. We can just hit them all with a single AKP. I think. There you go. Right. There is a blue depot here. I haven't really been using blue ammunition. I haven't really been using blue ammunition, unfortunately. Well, fortunately, unfortunately. Some level of something or other. Good, pick that up. Fire it out. Hi, buddy. Nope, okay. Shield down. We'll walk around, shall we? Go double ammo over there, nice. Double ammo is always nice. Okay, right, so Oxybell is doing quite well. Cool over there as well. Hi. I need to I need to, I need to practice my my arc accuracy. My I was gonna say my archery, my accuracy with the preacher. The preacher does hit like a truck. I just need to hit with it. Let's 
get out of the mud. Good. Okay, right. Clear this out. Bam. Walk over here. Got that out. Good. Right, so we can technically leave. We need to finish up the garrisons and everything else. Really? Good. Okay, so far so good. Okay, so we got a structure down there still, so we'll go work on that structure. Go work on that structure. Okay, so far so good. Got an AKP shot over here. Good. And work our way around. Single preacher shots, all we need. Okay, turn around because there's a captain over here somewhere. Yep, captain down. One more captain to go. One more structure to go. Now, it's a valid point. Is it actually worth me going hunting down for all these things? I mean, I'll go for I'll go hunting for the depots, but is it worth my time? Otherwise, I'll just do the captain's garrisons. I guess you get bonuses. You get like an extra two hundred and fifty before multipliers, I suppose. So, yeah, I guess, I guess it is worth it. I guess it's worth it. Maybe not spending ten minutes looking for it, but it's, in general, it's probably worth if you come across them to blow them up. Okay, over here. The guns over there. Okay, gun. Okay, we got the got the comm towers at least over here. Okay, uh, structure over there. Come on, let's get a move on. You go quick. Need to go quick. Got to run fast. All right, I think we, I think I could just press up and fire. Right? Not quite. Close enough though. Step. Good. And make my way out this way, I think. Fill up on health while we're here. Let's make a move. Let's make a move. Would the Oxybellius count as a heavy mech, I wonder? Would it count as a heavy mech, I wonder? I'd say it's a medium mech at best. I guess the Preacher is kind of, is technically a small weapon. It's a powerful weapon. But it's a small weapon. As long as, as long as if this is wielding two heavies. It's wielding like a main weapon and a small weapon. Good. That's that done. Next. Tenements. Let's learn these maps then. I don't think this is as sneaky as the other one was. It's got way more damage. It's got way better damage than the other one did. It definitely has way more damage than the other one did. I also walked straight into the middle of this. This is probably a bad idea for me. That was, that was... Wow, that was me being so stupid. That was me being so stupid. Let's do that again, shall we? Alright, let's rush this. I'm gonna rush the first mission as soon as possible. As hard as possible. Let's just rush the mission. Get, 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 destroy when he's destroying. Move. That was me being so stupid. That was me being very stupid at all. Okay. Clear out when he's clearing out. I'll take captains and I'll take structures. Then we'll leave. I'm going to rush this one. This 
the Necropolis. Okay, so we started off in the Necropolis this time. Okay, got you. Right, again, rushing specifically for what I need to dig. Thank you. Right, specifically for what I need. We're we'll gonna come quick clear. Okay, got all that nonsense? Good. Okay, so. One down. It's over here. I need to rush it. I need to rush this. That was a waste. That was a criminal waste of time. On what was a really good mech. That was me being stupid rather than me being outplayed. That was me being very, very stupid. Got captain down. Me, that was me charging forwards into a place I knew had uh, self-destructing mechs. Okay, so the captain there is gone. Let's go for the next captain down. Keep going next sort of anti-clockwise order. Captain, structure captain. Clearing out things as we need to. But captain, structure captain. Oops, it wasn't already, it was facing the way. Not bad. Well, he wants to, if he wants to stay away, I'm not going to stop him. Let's keep going. Okay. Ammo. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Structure captain, let's do this. Structure over here, we just walked past the structure. We just walked past the structure. That structure moved, which means it's close. There it is, it's over there. Okay, keep going down. Good, and... Got this guy, and go, wha-bam! Wha-bam! Got an alarm. Come on. This is, me being, this is being, me being far less clever about things than I have been in the past. This is me being far less clever. Okay, so... You got the captains, the structure's down there. I've also got to deal with the damn... Walls, unfortunately. Come on. Good. Hit that. Brilliant. Now, all we need is a couple more structures. And we're out of here. One more structure. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is taking double the time because I died the first time. It's not good. I also need to reload. Doesn't help that uh, essentially they've all got their shields up because of the fact that because the alarm is going, they've all got their shields up, which means that it takes a lot longer to kill them. No depot around here, unfortunately. Great. Okay, we can now walk out. Uh, okay, this. I tell you, take that back. There's an important depot over here. Get this back. We need banshee ammo. Can you get to the full? Close enough. 
close enough over the really where kind of wish there was a mini map to be honest um although you don't really need a mini map because the maps are fixed if it was random maps mini map would be required but because it's fixed maps i don't think you really need one just it would just be convenient to remind myself of a level layout Seven preacher shots left. This is where we walked in as well. Okay, so 721 at the moment. Not great, to be honest. Ultimately, not great. Oh, there you are. Good. I can actually, I can actually reload on the way out. That's good. I'll make use of this very much. Reload. 3, 16, 19, 22, 25, 28. Done. Right. Good. We can walk out of there. Rancho's Valley is where we started last time. Again, I'm going to rush this now. This is not. This is not clear. This is kill what I require to kill and then get out. Got that. Oh, the rushing's a mistake. The rushing was a mistake. Run, 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 run. I can't rush. I cannot rush. If I rush, everything goes to pot. Everything goes to pot. This is a really good build. I'm being stupid because I died the first time around. I rushed the second time around. Because I rushed the second time around, I died again. I cannot afford to do this. I cannot afford to rush. I'm making pittance because I die. Most of my money is going into thing. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Preacher's good. Very, very good. Galinha, Chuffer. The thing is, like, the Banshee is just generally fantastic. And I think for a DPS weapon, you want, like, a. You definitely want a. You definitely want a single shot damage. And Preacher, I think, it might be the better one out here. Because that is a machine gun. No, that's not really a machine gun, because that's a... Uh, interesting. What is... It is a chain gun, so that's an auto cannon, cannon, chain gun, chain gun, mortar, chemical projector, laser, grail gun. Okay, let's try that out. Bit of, bit of, a, bit of a double chain gun issue here, but we'll see what we can do. Okay, that's okay. That's that's the one that is. That's what that is. That's what that is. Okay. This is just a test. I don't. I've got. I've not got enough time in this episode anymore to to rush it. So, like I said, rushing it is not my forte. I can't rush. I cannot rush. This has been a disservice to this build. Yeah, definitely not as good as alpha damage because it's a multiple hit. Very strong, but because it's not a single damage alpha hit, no AoE. Yeah, Preacher Cannon is definitely better, I think. Definitely better. Okay. I'll keep going until we can until we until we can no longer go. We'll keep going until we can no longer go. Uh, 
quite, quite, quite. Oh god. Kill it. Thank you. Yeah, I think we have an issue with going through shields as well, I think. Sheesh. That was an intense fight. That was an intense fight indeed. Okay. Yeah, okay. While this is a good weapon, I don't think it complements this one that well. You want a single alpha strike shot with AoE. Maybe the mortar, but I'm very bad I'm very bad at mortars. I'm very bad at judging where they need to land. Mortars require more skill than I'm capable of using. Yeah, come on. Come on, let's make it end. Yeah. Again, rushing doesn't really work, not my style. A uh, bit of a short episode today, folks, but uh, it'll have to do. I will catch you guys next week with a little bit more. I'm not sure how much more freelance I'm going to do. Um, but, um, yeah. Maybe at some later date I'll come back and do a campaign with, with, other, with other mechs. Okay, anyway, I'll catch you guys next week. There's at least one more week of Brigador, and then we'll see what happens. Catch you guys next time, folks. See you then. Bye.